Well, it's been a while, but I am back in my backyard. I'm going to do another round. I have, let's see, five things set up, as you can see behind me. And then I have a few things over here, one thing at least over here. So let's go ahead and take a look at what I'm going to do and start what I need to do. So I'm going to take you guys down. Take a look. So this one here is like an antique. And I think I'm going to paint it silver. I've been going back and forth on black and silver. Um, I think it's going to be silver. It's weird because what they did is they filled in the holes where the handles go. So I have to like re-drill them out. And then you can see the these are like keyholes or something. But I don't know. I need to be able to open and shut those drawers. So I have to figure out. It's neat though, they have the keyhole. Maybe I'll put maybe I'll put something like underneath there or something. And then they've scratched something and well that looks like it's scratched, but it's not. That's just I don't know what that is. So anyways, this is the antique dresser, which I think is really neat. But like I said, I've been going back and forth and back and forth. What do I wanna do? Do I wanna do I wanna do black? Do I wanna do silver so I think I'll do silver so then I, this one here I've got over here as you can see I've got all lined up this one here I picked up not actually two weeks ago cute little thing I've done a few of these before um I've got to check that bottom drawer check the drawers out this I'm going to go with a Havana cream which is like a color of melted butter uh, I did think like gray for a moment or two, but oh look at it has, I didn't see that, it has a, uh, oh boy, what can I do there, fill it in, that's a lot of filler, can you see that, in the, that is something I have to think about, but it's got to be fixed, so maybe I'll try to put some filler in there, this side looks good. So, it's cute. There's the back. The other one that I have is this thing. This one has some tracks that need to be re-glued. And all the tracks are there, so luckily I can do that. This is a little... It's going to go with a basic brown on this one. Um, this one here is like not not you know it's not a high quality dresser but uh, it's still nice and once I get it painted up and it looks I think it'll turn out pretty good the more I think of it though that one might I'm looking at those handles and I've done those handles before with a uh, I think I'm just gonna stick with brown simple basic so then I got over here, I've got another school desk, and I should be doing this in August, end of August, because it'll probably sell immediately, but I'm just going to do, do it now and see if anybody wants it. If not, I'll put it aside and sell it closer to school time. This one here has like a drawer malfunction. This one here is a more of a higher quality dresser, you can just tell, and how it is when you move it around and stuff and it's got the felt lined inside there and so this one I'm going to go black just give it a fresh coat of black check out the drawers to see what's going on with them and like I said it's more of a solid heavier dresser so should turn out pretty good it's otherwise it's in pretty good shape So that's them. So now I have to start somewhere, don't I? I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by gluing um, pieces. i got to get my stand here. Start by gluing those tracks on this right here. So I'm going to line them up and get them 
glued. I actually thought the tracks were going to be in a lot worse shape than they were. Yeah. I thought I was going to have to buy all new tracks or something, but once I looked into it, it's not that bad. So, okay. And it's hot out. I mean, this tarp is hot. I was barefoot and it's, it's too much. So let me just go ahead and take these off. I'll also probably take off these. Basically, I just have to make sure that I put the, glue the tracks in the right place. Let them sit for probably 24 hours, and then I can go ahead with the rest. Oh yeah, and look at the inside. Some of the inside of these drawers need to be fixed as well. So, they're kind of like... Okay, let's get into this. Oh, it's so, if you can see out here, like this, this one's stuck on there. This one is not. I'm just trying to kind of line it up where it's supposed to be. It is stretches. It'll be good when I get done with it. basic black. Now I can see where the print was for where it was before. So if I kind of just line it up the same. I just have to make sure it's correct because when I push the drawer in and out it's on a, on a track. Here's the glue. I even got my yeah. what you guys can see because it's the sun. Oh, and other people are using my glue so it's kind of a mess. Oh. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just put the drawer in so that I know it's completely lined up. It's not going to glue the drawer in there, so, but it will be on the right track. Which will mean that I can't really work on the drawer yet. But I don't want the, this to be off. Shape. Right. This wasn't a good idea after all, right? It'll be fine. 
fine once I get it in the right spot. On the track. that out. So we're going to put this one over here too, and then the other one over there on the other side. It has nails in it. So I'm just going to do the same thing and then otherwise I think all these are good. that this piece is back. Oh yeah it is. It's all the way. I want to make sure I push that piece back. Against the, the, against the back of the dresser. Here's my other. This one. Start working on the actual drawers and stuff. This one needs, yeah, this one needs help too. A lot of glue in, I think. Okay. Both sides are in, they both push back. Okay, good. Why is that funny? It's got to be just in the right spot. And wherever I put it is how I want it to be lined up, so as long as it's in the like 
like that. Looks lined up. Okay, so that's those drawers. Just one step at a time. So that'll be right, and then I can go, like I said, from there I will check out. From there, I'm gonna once it's dry, I'm gonna check out all the drawers, get them lined up. They're weird and. Well, maybe we should go check out these other drawers while I'm doing them, huh? See if we can't figure out what. That looks good, though. Okay, let's go see what else we can do. Go down here to this one. Okay. So this is this cute little one here. So, in the shade, that's nice. And let's check these drawers out. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, look what we got going on. It just kind of has like a chunk out of the back of this one right here. Middle one is good. Let me, uh, you know what I have to do? I have to, uh, mark them. Shoot, this is not drawer number two. Drawer number two looks good in the bottom one as well. Well, drawer number three works in drawer number two. Maybe they're just in the wrong spot. This one is in bad shape. Hmm. What is wrong? It's like it's uh you know what it is. Gosh, it looks like it's Obviously been fixed, but see these these knobs are here to stop the drawer from going further. So that's okay. But let me try to draw another two in the top. It looks good. So uh, that just means that I have two bad drawers. Ooh. Yeah, look at it. Okay, so this one here is coming apart. We got it's coming all apart right up here. I'll show you. See? I gotta throw this junk out. That's gross. And this one here obviously is got something going on. I'm gonna go get see how it's coming apart. Like, see if you can see this right here on the seams. There's gaps right there. So I'm gonna go get my hammer and try to hammer it in closer and things. So, and also I need to uh, I need to get something for these knobs. I can take them off. I'm gonna go get my hammer. I'll be right back. What do you need? You need to go inside? Oh, okay. Yeah, I can help you. Bridget needs to go inside. Just give me a minute, okay? Probably have to go and do something. Okay, so I'm going to hammer. There's like a space right here. I'm just going to hammer. See, what it is, I think, is this is like out of line. Let 
Oh yeah, look at I'm going to have to take this in for this. Okay. Let me just hammer this. See, they, they put nails in it to fix it. But I think they didn't make it square. See how it Now my thing is this, what can I do? Okay, so when so like these are these are put together pretty good. So this one here I'll check because it's it is falling apart more. But this one here is like definitely nailed really good and stuff. I don't want to take it apart. But what I can do is uh find the problem spot and try to sand it down and tweak it a little bit. So I'm going to go get my sander. I'm also going to get a marker. Wow. Okay, so. It's like it sits right there. But it's also low. See how it's low? Because it's crooked. Sometimes they work better in a different spot, but they definitely are going to work better in there. Yeah, right here. Just. put nails all over up on here. Go. I'm going to look at this one closer, which means a lot of opening and shutting and brainstorming to try to figure out what I want to do with that. This one here, too. And so I'm going to bring you guys back after I do a little work on here because this next part's just going to be a lot of thinking.